Yo, what's up guys? Dell's Paradise here. Go tell your friends that I've got a new Minecraft series running up here. So, I'm going to start up on my world and show you guys a little bit about what I've got running on my world. So, first of all, I'm going to get my world set up here and show it off to you guys. I've had this world, I think, since around the game came out. Alright, so... I'm gonna move away from the spawn here, where I'm at, over here. Alright, so this is my house that I just built. I wanted to let you guys know that I wasn't doing, I wasn't even active on Xbox, YouTube, or anything for the past month or so. So I just started getting back on, on YouTube here. So I'm just letting you guys know that for now on, I might take a little bit of breaks, but I'll try to let you guys know before I do that, instead of what I did right now, which I didn't even let you guys know. So, what I'm going to do is just show you guys what my world's a little bit about. Alright, this is my house. It's just for survival, even though this world is on creative right now, but this house is for survival. I've got chests for fighting, hunting eating, enchantment table, enchanted stuff in there. I've got a whole bunch of cats in here. These are tame and these are wild lions in here, so just leave those alone. So I'm going to move out of this house and just show you guys the rest of my world here. Second, I'm going to show you, not this to my right, not the big obsidian thing, but this little log cabin was just for fun, just a little, just to make the world look a little bit, or actually, it's just a little sprinkle added onto the world, so, that's a sprinkle here. Here is my friend Itchy Running Gun's house, he just finished this building, building this the other day, I'm sorry, and I've just raided his house with paintings, and this painting's kind of awkward, because I'm not even sure what the hell that is, when I first thought, I thought that girl was like, being raped or bouncing on this pig man. By bouncing, I just mean bouncing, and I think that most of you would know what that means. But, and behind here, he's got glowstone to make these stairs extra special, and they're cool, but I don't think he's got anything in his house. Nothing here. So, I'm gonna move on out of here. And, I use so many paintings that it is now impossible to use anymore the maximum number of paintings in the world. So, there you have it. Next, I'm going to show you guys over here. I've kind of built some bridges and natural look with wood and stuff. I've kind of, it's like a base out here. So I've got this out here and I've just like put bridges across and stuff to make it kind of look in a little cooler than it was normally. So I did this Next, I've got over here, well, I don't want you guys to see the rest of the world, so I'm just going to like cover that up with the screen, so I've got my mansion. This is my mansion. I don't know why all the, uh, the doors are screwed up like that, but this is my mansion here, and I built it a while ago, not too long. Um, I built one similar on my cousin's world, so I just wanted to make one in my world with that kind of white wood and the spruce wood or whatever it is. Then I've got a really large dinner table in here, and I've got a portal to the ender, but I'm not going in there because it's pointless because I already beat the ender dragon. So I'm going to close these doors. Next, um, this is the fire pyramid just a fire pyramid, nothing really special. Not sure what's around this, but it's got a cross on it, and that represents Jesus, because Jesus is Jesus. Now, next, we've got kind of these cities, these houses here. This right here, this house that I'm walking over right now, this was my original house. I've had this house since the start of the world. I built this little garden in there. Then I made this house out of wood planks. And 
it was originally wood, and then I built diamond blocks with the duplication glitch, and then built glowstone on top or over that just to make another layer. And I've kind of abandoned this. I mean, not gonna go in the mine because I'm probably gonna get lost by the sign. You got a furnace room over there. You got a whole bunch of chests for all this mining stuff and the nether, and they're all sorted out. Damn, all these doors are screwed up. So, I got this little cool fountain. Next, I've got this creeper. And he's pretty cool. I just didn't do the detailed look of it. Sorry, but it's it's a creeper. I had a secret entrance right here going under to get through to the top of it. I'll do that now. Just show you guys the view from up here. Ah. Alright, here's the head right here. Then you go up and you can see the rest of my world. I've got a stadium right there, which it's a soccer stadium. Not a big fan of soccer at all, but it was the easiest stadium to work. Football field was just going to look horrible unless I made it gigantic, so I made a soccer field, and it's all right. The goals look kind of funky, but it's all right. So up next, I want you guys to meet Jeff. He's right here. He's got a... I'm not sure what this is, but it's... It's kind of weird. I've never seen one of these. It looks like a hose, maybe. I don't know. But it's something attached to him. I don't know what it is, but Jeff's got... Shining bright diamonds in the sky. His eyes are shining bright like a diamond. And he's got some facial hair, but... Those are some nice uh, biceps. And that's nice hose. But... This is my castle. I got a watchtower up here. Also a secret entrance. You can't get in unless you go over here. Through here. I just fixed up the entrance here. You gotta go down here. Then up around here. It's confusing. But here it is up here. I've got it's really big. Huge. The watchtower's up there. I'm not gonna go up there. I got simple stuff see that's a furnace thought that was a dispenser at first because that's what we did to make this it was before creative came out so we have this whole giant thing we've got where we sleep and store our stuff here's the dispensers for the glitch I'm not sure if there's anything still in there because this was a long time ago so this is where we sleep before we go into the wrestling arena and we put our stuff in there then we battle and stuff it's pretty fun so this is the main room in the castle then I've got, you can go around it it's really big so I'll just leave it at that I kinda took a really long time to make and a lot of people helped me make it <sighs> up next I've got let's see here I've got a country club which does not have a very good reputation right now because it's burned down so I've got um, stuff it, stuck in this up stuff. What is that stuff? I'm not sure. But this is a country club. It has a really bad reputation for burning town. Burning down. And you can see by the fireplace covered up in stone. That's what has burned this thing down multiple times. Here's a poker table here. You got the fireplace with cool piston tables. Cool design on the floor. And then we got a bar that my cousin Michael made. Pretty sweet look. Looks like a tiki bar to me. And then we have this like outdoor deck. This is also cool. I like the glowstone lamps. I did most of the stuff out here. And there you have the country club. Next. Let's see what I've got next. Oh yeah. I forgot. I've got a uh, uh, small little tiny fire pyramid out here. Really small. It was really easy to make. It took like just an hour, you know. Just not long at all. Just really, really short. Just took no effort to make at all. And when you go inside, it's pretty sexy. You can see like sparkles when you move. When you don't move, you see nothing. But when you start to move, then you can just see all the cracks and the fire on the outside of it. And it's big in here. It's really, really big and wide. 
and long. I mean, it's just huge in here. So you can see that huge, a lot of glowstone. Then I've got this fancy stone brick path that goes back to shore. Here, I was just messing around with a couple of my friends, blowing shit up. We use obsidian to get down there and back up because it doesn't blow up. Then, I've got another fire pyramid here. Um, again, most of these houses I'm not going to go through because they're my friends and I don't really feel like going and expecting, inspecting all their houses, so I'm just going to leave them where they are. That's most of my world, but then I'm going to warn you guys right now, if any of you guys are Jewish, you should probably change the video to something more educational because I've got a concentration camp right here and it's pretty sweet not sure what this lover does no idea but the spider webs represent like the barbed wire on top of a fence we've got an archery range up here to shoot down onto the Jews we've, they've got big noses you can see that they're obviously Jewish they talk to each other, kind of look, uh, I don't know what they look, but they look pretty Jewish. Again, I'm not prejudiced or anything, but we've got an oven in here. We've got a fire pit down here. Another pit down there to fall to your death. And in here we have a little drowning thing that's in the back corner. I'll let these guys at home go. God damn it. Get out of the way. Fucking Jews. So this... Lever pulls down the water to make them drown. But it's not really fixed right now. It was working, so usually would drown them, and now I'm stuck in here with them. So I'm going to get some nether brick fence to replace here. Don't let any of them out because they'll want to escape. Put on their yarmulkes. So, I don't know what Enos or whatever that is. What is that? Is that a nipple? Looks like a nipple or something that needs to be breastfed. There's no baby there breastfeeding, so I'm not really sure what that is. But, let's see. I want you guys to let me know in the comments what I should do. If I should start a series building stuff, start a survival world, start a survival like world on here. Just let me know what I should do with how this is going. Tell me some ideas on what to build because I'm not really that great at this game. I'm good at like designs and stuff. My cousin kind of designs Jeff here. I did the castle and the stadium and the creeper and stuff and the mansion. But a lot of people helped me do this. Again, Itchy Run and Gun and It's Blue building his house over there. So thanks to them. Thanks to my cousin Michael for helping me build but let me know guys what I should do give me some ideas on what to do and maybe I'll probably get a whole bunch of you guys on the server at once at once at some time we could all just build on creative so let me know but for now I'm just going to say thanks for watching guys